Welcome to WMI TV News. I'm Laura Singleton. This news is being driven to you by Horn Auto Center, the Chevy store that saves you more. The White Mountain Community Food Bank, which operates out of the back of the Living Waters Church, is in danger of having to shut down. The local food bank has to find a new home by March 19th of next year because the church has been sold. I don't think they ever thought something like this would happen, Food Bank Director Norma Smith said. She also said all it would take on the low end is about $300 a month to stay put. Smith said they operate solely on public donations, adding that she is paying the monthly rent out of her own pocket. Smith said it does not look promising that they'll be able to stay past December. For details, see reporter Mike Leiby's story in your Tuesday, August 28th edition of The Independent. Now for the weekend review. If you were out and about this weekend, you probably noticed a lot going on in our White Mountain communities. Here's a few pictures from the Happy Tales Benefit for the Humane Society of the White Mountains. This event was held Saturday at Charlie Clark's Orchard in Pine Top. Richard Klein and the Peacemakers, a well-followed band around Arizona, Texas, and Mexico, played at the Lion's Den, drawing hundreds of music lovers. The Sholo Emblem Club also held their annual variety show and luncheon at the Elks Lodge in Sholo. On a more somber note, Senator John McCain passed away Saturday after battling brain cancer for more than a year. He was 81 and made many visits to the White Mountains in his lifetime. Your weather forecast is brought to you by White Mountain Publishing. Today's forecast calls for a high of 80 under mostly sunny skies. Tuesday also, also promises clear conditions with a high of 82 degrees. The remainder of the week looks sunny and fair with no signs of the rain we experienced last week. More details on any of the news you've heard today can be found on our website, our Facebook page, or the print edition of your Tuesday or Friday Independent. Remember, today's news was driven to you by Horn Auto Center, the Chevy store that saves you more. Thank you for watching. I'm Laura Singleton.